yeah, I would like to say something about Facebook because as it is, I was, um, um, I was clarifying that the world right now is really kind of not running <coughs> without Facebook because everybody's using it, and that is so very important to feel <coughs> kind of a little bit of celebrity and have your photos here and there and uh, some likes and being admired and <coughs> have this possibility kind of to be in. On a well, on a page, nearly on a page of a magazine, it just looks like Facebook. But at the same time, I think it is. Um, it can be a tool for, for a huge, um, well, well-being and huge happiness in your life. But at the same time, uh, it can cause a pain in your life because there is so many. Um, there are so many different functions here and there and to get to these functions to get through uh it really it costs you like hours of kind of getting <coughs> related to this tool and to this machine so um sometimes i think that I, using facebook is uh, a thing which is kind of bringing peace but at the same time which is really bringing a lot of um problems and negativity because uh, for example, there are some um, <clears throat> some hidden groups where people are um, uh, discriminized or people are, um, well, maybe kind of <clears throat> stumbled upon or um, or maybe they are made, uh, made even prostitutes or they are somehow uh, put into the shoes of very big negativity and uh, some groups of people are talking about one or two people a person as a very bad one so the life of these uh, two people are uh, is endangered um, these things are occurring in my mind and then there is this huge tool of um, well getting everybody uh, found it is it means literally you can find everybody uh, using Facebook because if you are having just a photo on your uh, mobile you're able to find this person maybe through some apps uh, in Facebook. So this is why I think it could be a tool for really uh, great great um, achievement because if we are having a lot of orphans and uh, we don't know who they are and where they're coming from and we are putting them all on Facebook and giving them the possibility of having their own uh, profiles uh, filled with data and filled with um, <clears throat> the story of their lives, it could be a different world, uh, world because uh, then these people are not somehow hidden somewhere and they're not, uh, they're just not lost, but they're uh, in the front of the audience of the entire world and they're able to tell their story and be able to be found by the parents which are uh, interested in uh, adoption and this or that person but at the same time I really think that it should be a different it should be a different um, company uh, really called Adopt Me or Adoption Worldwide which would be ruling this world of uh, adoptions because I think it is so crucially important to um, protect the life of every child and every teenager and every young adult because as it is uh, parents of the Western society in Western countries, they are still having kind of children uh, in the age of 27 and they're getting governmental help for these children, meaning that <coughs> even the orphans in the age of 26, maybe they can be adopted and they be, um, can be given a possibility for um, a life and, you know, in a family and uh, like in a life and happiness and not a life of struggles and uh, you know hunger and poverty so I just really think that uh, there should be a new company uh, which is enormously strong and uh, presented worldwide in every country because orphans are spread over the world and, and they are in every country and this company should be really connecting the entire um, generations and children and adoptive parents and uh, make it possible that uh, they are finding themselves and they are having help immediately of psychotherapists or 
they're able to <clears throat> maybe adopt a pet if they want to or they are maybe to uh, maybe able to even find the biological parents and i think it is really important that this company does exist and it is brought into the world um, by me uh, by my fantasy and by my boldness and <clears throat> i think it is really important that um, it is enormously international and uh, it does um, yeah exist with the help of the best web developers worldwide which are have a big heart uh, for children or for uh, adoptions and orphans and it is supported by the government worldwide because it is i think this is the work of the government or of the police and uh, psychotherapists to get to these children which are hiding themselves and uh, I'll bring them to some kind of a orphanage in the like in the in the middle uh, middle of the adoption and then to uh, bring them to the parents so these are my thoughts to this um, topic and I think uh, Facebook is a great platform but this is better for making friends and uh, to find orphans <coughs> and to adopt them it's really it needs um, an extra company working just for this purpose because I think orphans and um, adoptive children they're always there they're always gonna be uh, persevering worldwide and we're always having new children to be adopted because uh, people are always having sex or producing themselves and uh, bringing some unneeded un you know not needed uh, children into some um, hospices and orphanages and uh, hospitals so I'd like really this company to be there in the world and called adopt me or adoption for a bit <laughs>